Robert Irwin changed the way people look at art. It's about perception. It's about getting you to tune in to your place and the environment around you. Catherine Kandra is director and CEO of the Museum of Contemporary Art San Diego. She said Irwin, who was born in 1928, started out as an abstract expressionist painter in the 1950s, but he soon evolved. In the 1960s, a group of Southern California artists developed the light and space movement. They worked with light, whether with actual light bulbs, ambient light, shadows, or the perception of light. Take Robert Irwin's discs, for example, on view at MCASD. The way the light plays with the object almost makes its edges disappear. His most famous work in San Diego is One Degree, Two Degrees, Three Degrees, Four Degrees, which features three square holes cut directly through the museum's windows. The holes let the breeze in, frame nearby palm trees and the coastline, and blur the lines between inside and outside. In an interview with KPBS in 2007, Irwin said he wanted to lean into the idea that what people may see out the window is as good as any art. Well, actually, uh, when I stopped being a studio artist, I was very interested in the idea of dealing with spaces, but I didn't want to objectify them. I didn't want to put things in them. I wanted you to deal with the, the quality of the space itself. Other Irwin works refract light and blend into the wall or draw your gaze to the beauty of the landscape. More of Irwin's work is on view at the nearby Quint Gallery in La Jolla. Some pieces use actual fluorescent light tubes that transform and captivate when lit up. Others remain intentionally unlit. Mark Quint, the gallery owner, said Irwin had a hero personality to him. I think Bob, as a lot of people do, probably as a philosopher's artist, there are artists, artists, um, Bob was more concerned with the idea of looking and seeing and beauty, and his legacy would be one of t saying, you know, take a look, look closely. He is an artist uh, for the generations, but, but he comes out of our moment. Julia Dixon-Evans, KPBS News.